All right, welcome back to Whiskey Channel. And today, I have knives. And what I'm gonna do is pair these two up and these two up. These are the bigger ones, these are the smaller ones. And see, um, this is a stick, and which ones are better at slashing and stabbing. So let's get into it. Here's this one. Very nice. It's not too heavy or nothing. Um, so I'll, um, let me see, I'll do, um, one of these, and then one of these, and I'll see, because it has multi, multiple knives on them, so I'll just pair up the ones that look the most similar with slashing and, um, stabbing, and I guess we'll start out with stabbing, so I'll get this one undone, and then we can start on it. Alright, so here's both of these out. Um, I know it doesn't look like this is open all the way but this is as far as it goes I think it's bent a little bit that's all right so like I said we'll start with stabbing let's have it on this side better test and three two one all right it's got a pretty good little nick in it let's try this one Do this one over here to the left three two one all right so um I'd say that was actually pretty much a tie because this one, yes, is bigger. It made a bigger dent, but they both give off a good stab. Um, this one is much more sturdy and stable than this one is, but um, I'd say they both are have the same amount of sharpness. Let's see about cutting. Um, well, slashing anyway. Three. All right, got some pretty good slashes going. And wait a second. All right, yep. This is kind of hard when you have the hammer right there. Let's see here, I can do it like that. Well, I just cut myself. That's kind of nice, ain't it? Or did I? Oh, it's okay. It's just under the skin. Yeah, don't do this at home. Yeah, that hurts. I'll be fine. Oh yeah, definitely. This one's much more better at um, the slicing than this one. So, since they were tied for the first one and didn't for the second one, this one is your winner. I'm gonna go uh, clean myself off and we'll be back. Alright, so here's the band-aid. Um, and I did realize that this is just a, um, a blood blister, so it hurts really bad, but there's no blood outside of my hand, or outside of my finger, so I'll put these up, get these out, and, um, then we'll do the tests for them. Alright, so here's these. This one right here is my army knife. Um, it's pretty nice. Um, an old, um army dude had given it to me and it has a flint in it or the whetstone so you can sharpen it and then in the bottom here is a little compass and it has matches on the inside so it's a very useful tool um, it has the sheath of course this one right here is just a little switchblade type thing um, but we'll get to that one later this one is very very light and I love it it's almost lighter than this one or you'd expect this to be a lot heavier than it actually is so um, I guess we'll go for the stab test. And it has these little braces there to, you know, right there to keep you from stabbing yourself like I did. So here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, there we go. That's a good one. See, it's always good. This one goes deeper, but not as thick as um, this one did over here. So let's do it again. One, two, three. All right, that's a pretty good one. And I guess I can do the slash well, no. Yeah, it'll be easier if I just do it like this. Now, this one is much bigger, as you can see. Look, look at the comparison to this. The blade right here is almost as big as the actual army knife itself. And you know that army knives are not... I mean, it looks like my hand's bigger, but look. I mean, this is a... I don't have small hands either, so, you know, this thing is gigantic compared to an army knife. So here, let's do the stab test for this one. Three, two, one. All right. 
All right, that one definitely is going um, deeper in than this one. So let's try it again. One, two, three. Oh, got it in the ground. All right, one, two, three. Uh, got it in the ground again. One, two, three. Nope, too far. One, two, three. There we go. Oh my goodness. Look how deep that thing went compared to all the other ones. It's like, let me wipe this off. It's like Jaws versus a normal shark. And look, there's hardly any damage to it at all. Which is surprising. Let's see about the other ones. Any damage? Nope. To none out of them. Alright, then we'll do the slashes. And I will get that out of the way so I don't cut myself even more. Because it, it will hurt. Alright, one, two, three. Alright, so this one is... Not that sharp, actually. Uh-oh. See, look. This is just getting grass in my fingers and more so than actually clean. Anyway, all right, let's do this one. Now that one's facing down, so it's all right. Let's see here. Yep, there is no comparison. This one definitely wins. This one, um, this is my grandmother's knife that she gave to me. She said, here you go, boy. Um, you can take that on your camping trips for, um, for Boy Scouts. And I was like, yeah, we're not allowed to have knives as this big. So, um, here's these. Um, here's some thunder in the background. So, um, yeah, this was, I liked this. This was pretty fun. So, um, yeah, there we go.